The overall panache is very much like its larger displacement brethren in the lineup with a wide front fairing that houses dual headlights below a generous windscreen that punches a hole in the wind to form the protective pocket for the rider and comes vented to help reduce turbulence. Recessed turn signals ride below the twin beams to help keep the front end relatively clean as it flares to form a sport bike style cowl that funnels cooling air over the radiator and forms the front of the leg guards. Dual analog dials and a LED screen make up the instrumentation that sits tucked deep under the screen and displays the critical metrics with the addition of an eco drive feature that essentially notifies you when you're getting a little too twisty with it for maximum fuel economy. Just think of it as a shift light, but for the throttle instead of the gearbox. The inner fairing comes equipped with two small storage compartments and a 12 volt power point so you can plug in your mobile device, GPS receiver or whatever. A slight tunnel breaks up the step through just a scotch, but doesn't really interfere with mounting dismounting actions though it definitely messes with the tween feet storage possibilities. The bench seat puts the rider's butt at a comfortable 28.9 inches off the ground. Plus it carries a heavily sculpted shape that's nice and narrow up front so as to not bite into your inner thighs and force your legs uncomfortably wide, at least when they're on the long footboards. Shorter inseams should be plenty comfortable, but if you shop in the big and tall section, you may find it a trifle cramped. There's a dramatic rise to the pee pad that forms a nice scoop for the rider and an elevated platform for your passenger with extensions to the rider's footboards that give your riding partner a nice, secure place for his or her feet. As usual, the seat flips up to reveal a storage compartment that, on paper, has enough room for two full-face buckets, but you'll do well to keep in mind that larger buckets and modular units may not squeeze in there. Grab rails finish out the passenger's gear on the wide rear end that sports dual, recessed tail turn lights and a plate holder mudguard unit to knock down the rear wheel fling.